Thank you for coming back to journey with us into the last hour of Yom Kippur. This has been quite a special Yamim Hanoraim, a 10 days of awe. We joined together for Rosh Hashanah and then this morning for Yom Kippur. And now this evening, and we know that in a little while we'll have break the fast, but before that we have our Ni'ila service and even a taste of mincha, the afternoon, haftarah. Now by the Ni'ila service, what I mean is the service that closes Yom Kippur. And the rabbis in choosing that word closing, they were referring to a closing of the gates of repentance. The metaphor here is that there are these open gates that are there for us to remind us to apologize, reflect, mend, heal, whatever it is that's bothering us, especially in our relationships with other people, but also in our relationship with ourselves and with God. And a sense of urgency was cast before us. And now more than ever, as the moments are ticking away, is there any unfinished business that we want to do between us and God at this point inside of our souls, knowing that Jewish people all over the world and certainly all over this town here, even just in Los Angeles, are going through that same process now. Um, I'm so glad to be making the ELA, not just with all of you, especially with all of you, but also especially with Rabbi Ron, my wonderful colleague, Rabbi Ron Goldberg, and also Ben Siam Kogan, uh, who has been our cantor during these high holidays. So what we're going to do next is the Haftarah that is usually done on Yom Kippur afternoon, uh, a little bit before now, but we're doing it a little later than usual. And it's the Haftarah of the Book of Jonah. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech olam Asher bachar bin bin tovim Eretzah b'divrehem anem arim demet Baruch atah Adonai Abocher Batorav Moshe Abdo, of Yisrael Amo, in the Haimet Basedek. So, this is the story of Jonah, see Jonah, and the whale who looks a lot like Shamu. Hmm. You may remember the story. The story is of a man that God calls upon named Jonah to go to a city known as Nineveh. God says to Jonah, go to the city of Nineveh because the people there are so corrupt and evil that if you don't go there and persuade them to change their ways and become loving and good, I am going to wipe out the city much as I did with Sodom and Gomorrah, much as I did with the generation of Noah and the ark. Well, Jonah is what you might call a reluctant prophet, but he's extremely reluctant. And he says, I don't want this. And he runs away. He hops on a boat uh, headed to Tarshish. He, as a result of hopping on the boat, causes all this turbulence. 
uh, getting to the point where the other people on the boat recognize that he and his God are causing the problem. They throw him overboard with his permission hmm. and he gets swallowed up by a giant fish. It actually doesn't say whale in the Bible. It says big fish. And in this big fish, Jonah has time to reflect. And he does, and he prays, and he promises. And then eventually the fish gets so tired of him that the fish casts him back uh, onto the shore of Jaffa. And at that point, Jonah is ready to take on his mission. He goes to Nineveh. He persuades the people to change their ways. They do, which teaches us that a town, a city, a country, a, a generation can heal itself, can go from darkness and evil to being good and loving. And they do, they change so much so that God forgives them and allows the city of Nineveh to continue to exist. There's then a tail end of the story that's very obscure about a plant that grows and a worm that kills it. And Jonah kind of gets into a bad mood and is upset about the plant. And then God ends the whole story by saying to him, really, Jonah, you're worried about a plant when you didn't care about my entire town of people in the, in the city of Nineveh. What, why this story at all in the Bible, but more poignantly, why this story on Yom Kippur? Why not have a story of a prophet who's eager, as in some of the other Haftarot of the holidays, who's eager to serve God, who's eager to serve the Jewish people? And I think that the lesson here is that there's a Jonah inside of each and every one of us. We all know what we are supposed to do. Our conscience tells us what is right. But sometimes we run away uh, from goodness. Sometimes we even run away from responsibility. And it's hard to look back on your own life and say, is there more that I could have done? Is there a time that I wish I had fought more, spoken out better for the vulnerable, helped people that I knew more than I have? And for most of us, the answer, of course, is going to be yes, because there's always more we can do. On the other hand, we have the year ahead. And that's the most exciting part of the renewal that Yom Kippur offers us. And instead of worrying about the Jonah inside of us that ran away from the past, though being honest about it, looking ahead to the coming year and saying, where can I help? Where can I do better? Where can I say that nice word, do that nice gesture? Say the kind thing, and so on. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Sor kol amim sadik b'chol adorot Ha'el ha'neman ha'omer ve'oseh ha'medaber u'mekayem she'kol d'barahav emet b'tzedek Neman atahu Adonai Eloheinu v'nemanim d'varecha Adonai <laughs> Shalom yes benero lelaham vaed aruha ta adonai magain david ah amen that was so beautiful yashar koach rabbi ron thank you so much we now make our way into the neila service with its unique and special melody baruch ata Adonai Eloheinu Elohe Aboteinu Elohe Abraham Elohe Yitzhak Elohe Yaakov O El Hagadol Hagibor Bahamora El Elyon Go 
אומר חסדים טובים וקונה הכל וזוכר חסדי אבות ומביא גואל לבני בניהם למען שמו באהבה זוכרנו לחיים מלך חפץ בחיים וחותמנו בספר החיים למען כה אלוהים חיים מלך עוזר ומושיע ומגן ברוך אתה אדוני מגן אברהם Surav Lechaim Lerachamim We continue now with Lador Vador, which celebrates every generation. Lador Vador from generation to generation. Lador Vador, Lador Vador, Lador Vador Nagi God Lecha. לדור ודור, לדור ודור, לדור ודור נגיד גוד לך, ולנצח נצחים קדושתך נקיש, קדושתך נקיש, בשבחך אלוהינו מפינו לא ימוש, לא ימוש לעולם ועד, לדור ודור, לדור ודור. לדור ודור נגיד גוד לך, לדור ודור, לדור ודור, לדור ודור נגיד גוד לך, כי אל מלך גדול, גדול וקדוש, גדול וקדוש אתה. לה 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 Vatakwanu Sha'ar, before the gates on high swing closed, O oh God, now hear our prayer. As our lives we seek to mend, our pleas to your throne we send. Before the shades of night descend, O oh God, now hear our prayer. Before the gates on high swing closed, O oh God, now hear our prayer. Your children turn to you, stripped of claims to all virtue. Seeking your will to pursue, O oh God, now hear our prayer. Accept our penitential plea. Forgive us our iniquity. O oh, help us to live faithfully. O oh God, now grant our prayer. Yanu hamecha v'yata Eloheinu Anu hanecha v'yata ma'avi Anu avadecha v'yata Adoneinu Anu kehalecha v'yata chelkeinu Anu nafatecha v'yata goraleinu Anu tsonecha v'yata roeinu Anu charmecha v'yata notreinu Anu veulatecha v'yata yotreinu Anu rayatecha v'yata doreinu Anu segulatecha v'yata kroveinu Anu Amecha Yata Malkeinu Anu Mamirecha Yata Mamirecha 
We now arrive at the final Vidui, our last opportunity as a community to confess all of our collective sins with a commitment to being better in the year to come. It's our tradition to take our hands and tap our chest to wake up our hearts anew. Please feel free to repeat after me. Asham nu, bagahad nu, gazaham nu, dibar nu dofi, heavy nu, vehir shah nu, zahad nu, hamas nu, tafal nu sheker, ay, 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 ay. Yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-yai-
We continue with the Pirkata Kohanim, the priestly blessings, the opportunity for Rabbi Binder and myself to bless our congregation. May Adonai bless and protect you. May Adonai show you kindness and be gracious to you. May Adonai bestow favor upon you, and most importantly, grant us all the blessing of peace. In the book of life and blessing, peace and prosperity, may we and all your people, the house of Israel, be sealed for a good and peaceful life. Praise to you, Adonai, source of peace. Avinu malkeinu, chaneinu vahaneinu. Avinu malkeinu, chaneinu vahaneinu, ki hein banu masim. Aseimanu, tzedaka vachesed. Asei manu tzedaka vachesed vehoshienu. Asei manu tzedaka vachesed. Asei manu tzedaka vachesed vehoshienu. As we come toward the end of Yom Kippur, we're not quite there, but we're almost there. We actually make Havdalah. And I have here my Havdalah candle and I have my Kiddush cup. We don't use the spice box because it's not a Saturday night, but we're still distinguishing, which is what the purpose of Havdalah is, distinguishing between uh, good and evil, between the holy day and the regular days of the week. And the twisted candle and all of the multiple wicks remind us of the unity and intertwinedness, if that's a word, of the Jewish people. Rabbi Ron, is intertwinedness a word, or did I just make it up? It is a word now. It's a word now. I'm so glad. Now, Benzi, I think you too have a Havdalah set, don't you? I do. There, there's your Havdalah candle. Do you have your Kiddush cup handy? I do. All right. Well, this is so exciting. So Benzi will now lead us in Havdalah, and I'm going to light my candle as well. Are you lighting your candle? I am. Okay, here we go. Whenever you're ready. Okay. 
Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Borei Peri HaGafen Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Borei Melrei HaEch Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Amabdil Ben Kodesh Lechol Ben Or Lechoshech Ben Yisrael Amin Ben Yom Ashvi L'Sheshu Dimei Hamase Baruch Ata Adonai Amabdil Ben Kodesh Lechol Okay, Benzi, I'm going to put out my candle. Are you going to put yours out as well? I am. Here we go. It makes that wonderful fizzle sound. All right. Yasher Koach. We continue with the mourner's cottage, the silent testimony that links the generation, all those who are in mourning, all those observing your site, please join me in sanctifying God's holy name. Yit Gadal, the Yit Gadash, Shemei Rabbah, the Almal, the Brach, the Rute, the Amlich Malfute, the Chayechon, the Yomechon, the Chaye de Chol Beit Yisrael, Bagala Uvizman Kariv Vimru Amen. Yehesh me Rabba Mubarak Lolam Ume Omaya. Yit Barak Vishtabak Vi Paar Vitraman Viet Nase. Yet a dar Vit a Lev Yit a Law Shmeda Kudisha Kurehu. La Ela mean Kolber Kata Vishirata Tushbakata Venechamata. Damaran be alma, the imru, amen. Yehesh lama raba min shamaya, the chaim alenu vel kol Yisrael, the imru, amen. Ose shalom be romav, who yase shalom alenu vel kol Yisrael, the imru, amen. Amen. May the source of peace send peace to all who mourn and comfort to all who are bereaved, and we say together. Amen. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad. Hear, O Israel, Adonai our God, Adonai is one. Baruch Shem Kavod Malchuto Le'olam Va'ed. Baruch Shem Kavod Malchuto Le'olam Va'ed. Baruch Shem Kavod Malchuto Le'olam Va'ed. Praise be God's glorious sovereignty forever and ever. Adonai Hu Elohim. Adonai Hu Ha 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 Elohim. Adonai alone is God. I really want to thank all of you for being with us for this conclusion of Yom Kippur and want once again to thank my wonderful colleagues and John Lynn our IT specialist who's helped us put all of this together to be with you tonight. And Rabbi Binder, we thank you for leading us this entire holiday season. Amazing. Thank you so much. Uh, Rabbi Ron, are you ready for the final shofar blast? I have a shofar with me, even though I know you're the one blowing. Do you have it? I do. Fantastic. Rabbi Ron is going to make the final Tekiah Dola blast. I'll call it and he's going to blast. He's such a good shofarist. I love it. And right after he blasts the shofar, we are in for a very special treat. Our own resident, Michal Robbins, who's also president of Res Council at Eisenberg Village, is going to take us out of Yom Kippur with our final song of Leshana Haba Abiru Shalayim, which of course means next year in Jerusalem. The very same words that we used to conclude a Passover Seder is what we conclude Yom Kippur with. They are words of Hope. You ready, Rabbi Ron? Tikiya Gedola. Leshana. 
הבאה בירושלים, לשנה 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 הבאה בירושלים. אמן. יאשר קרח. תודה רבה. תודה רבה. תודה רבה. תודה רבה. תודה רבה. I am. I All am right, we've got, our, we've got our Kiddush. Here we go. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, Borei peri ha'gafen l'chayim. Some fluffy food. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech ha'olam, Amotzi lechem min ha'aretz. Amen. What a delicious round. Chal, I'm so grateful. For our dietary department, I'm going to take a bite right now. So great to finally break fast. And, and also, also Main and Shana Tova. Yes, and also we have our cookies because we're going to break fast with Rugalach, our cookies, and so Boremi Ne Mezonot as well. Amen. What were you saying, Benzi? I was going to say, and I'm going to say, Amen and Shana Tova to all. Shana Tova Matuka. Shana Tova. Have a great year, everyone. Uve Shofar Egadol Itaka. The cold Mamadaka Ishamah.